Welcome to Cup of Teach channel. Since you already know on how to transform the equations into the standard form, this time we are going to identify the value of a, b, and c. Let us recall first the standard form of quadratic equation. So, what is the standard form of quadratic equation? The standard form of quadratic equation is ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to zero, where a, b, and c are real numbers, and a is not equal to zero. ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to zero. a and b are coefficients, c is constant. Examples identify the value of a, b, and c. Number 1. x squared minus 6x plus 9 is equal to 0. The value of a is 1, the value of b is negative 6, and the value of c is 9. 2. 2x two squared minus 3x minus 7 is equal to 0. What is the value of a, b, and c? The value of a is 2. The value of b is negative 3, and the value of c is negative 7. Another example is x squared plus 10 is equal to 7x, written in standard form? No, therefore, we need to write it into the standard form. First, transpose 7x to the left side of the equation, so it will become negative 7x. The equation now is in the standard form. Let us identify the value of a, b, and c. The value of a is 1, the value of b is negative 7, and the value of c is 10. Try this 2x squared minus 6 is equal to 3x. First question is, is it quadratic equation, or not, and why? It is quadratic equation, because the highest exponent of x, is 2. 2. Write the standard form. 2x squared minus 6, is equal to 3x. First transpose 3x to the left side of the equation, so it will become negative 3x. Therefore, we will have 2x squared minus 3x minus 6 is equal to 0. 3. Find the value of a, b, and c. In 2x squared minus 3x minus 6 is equal to 0. a is equal to 2, b is equal to negative 3, and c is equal to negative 6. Thank you for watching. See you on the next lesson.